secondary memory. To store data permanently, a secondary memory is used as it has a lot of space to store data. It is also known as the auxiliary memory or the external memory. Many devices are used to store this memory. Let's learn about them. Secondary memory or storage devices. Secondary memory or storage devices are the data storage devices that are used in the computer to store the data. The computer has many types of data storage devices. In these storage devices, information remains stored permanently until the user erases it. There are two types of secondary memory or storage devices. Internal storage device or hard disk which is fitted inside the CPU box and external storage devices CD, DVD, Blu-ray disk, pen drive, memory card and external hard disk which are attached to the computer externally. Only the primary memory of a computer can help to access and use the data saved in these devices. Let's learn about these devices. Hard disk. Hard disk is a very significant secondary storage device for a computer. It is also called a hard drive. The CPU box contains the hard drive which stores the data saved by the user and the software used by the computer system. The already stored data can be removed and new data can be stored into it. Hard disks have a huge capacity for storing data. It can store up to 1 TB data. External hard disks are also available these days. They are also called portable hard disks. They are vastly used because of the size and the portability. They are used by being attached externally to a computer and help to store more data in addition to what is stored on the computer's hard disk. They are also used to back up the data that's saved on the computer's hard disk. Compact disk Compact disk is usually referred to as a CD. It is a popular and an economical storage device. It is circular in shape and is used to store data from a computer. A CD can store about 700 MB to 800 MB of data. A laser beam is used for storing data in the disk. It can store text, graphics, sound, images and videos. A CD can be run in a computer if it has a working CD-ROM. There are three types of CDs. CD-ROM or Compact Disk Read-Only Memory. It is a read-only CD which means that a user cannot change, delete or save more data to it. These types of CDs usually come preloaded with films or music or some other data. CDR Compact Disk Recordable It is a recordable CD. The data written once on this type of CD cannot be deleted. Therefore, the CD can only be used once. CDRW or Compact Disk Rewritable It is a rewritable CD. The data stored on it can be deleted and new data can be stored. Hence, it can be used again and again. Digital Versatile Disk Digital Versatile Disk is popularly referred to as DVD. From outside, it looks just like a CD. But the video and the audio quality of a DVD is much better than a CD. A DVD can store about 8.5 GB data. Laser beams are also used to read and write data. It can be played on DVD player. DVDs are also much stronger than CDs. A two-layer DVD can store double amount of data 
as compared to a DVD. Blu-ray disc The newest and the most superior type of storage disc is the Blu-ray disc. A Blu-ray disc looks the same as a CD and a DVD. It is called so because a blue-violet laser is used to read and write the data written on it. It can store 25 GB or more data. It cannot be played in a CD-ROM player. A Blu-ray player is needed to play it. USB Drive A USB drive is a very small and compact device to store a large amount of data. It is also called a flash drive. It is available in a variety of storage capacities from 2 GB to 2 TB. It just has to be inserted into any of the USB ports of a computer and then the data saved on it can be accessed and used easily. A USB drive is a very durable storage device and it also keeps the data very secure. Its contents can be modified and deleted by the user and data can be rewritten. It is also called a pen drive or a thumb drive. Memory card A memory card is used as a storage media for portable devices like a mobile, a digital camera and a music player. It can be removed for access by the computer. 